French author Albert Camus once said that autumn is a second spring where every leaf is a flower. The changing leaves not only signal the visual change in season from summer to fall, but also signal the arrival of the inevitable <laughs> flu season. Centers for Disease Control reports that approximately 200,000 Americans are hospitalized each year due to influenza, and for those who spend a lot of time on a college campus, germs and bacteria spread easily. I don't get the flu very often, so I think I'm going to take my chances. Although some choose to fight off the flu virus on their own, many other students and faculty here at WKU have chosen to get a flu shot that is offered at the Health Services Center on campus. We've given roughly 940 doses for the adult vaccine. Terry Cunningham, marketing coordinator at WKU Health Services, says that the flu shot they are providing this year protects against both the influenza A and B viruses, as well as the 2009 H1N1 virus, all in one shot. It's not going to make you have the flu if you get the shot. A lot of people are uh, leery of getting the shot because they think that it will give them the flu, but that's not true. Right in here. Getting the vaccination um, will definitely help protect you from getting the flu. Cunningham goes on to say that WKU Health Services strives to educate about the flu and ways to prevent it. Make sure they wash their hands if they are sick, sneeze into your upper arm. Last year, Health Services spent about $20,000 on the campus sanitary system, including pocket hand sanitizers, dispensers, and informative posters. So whether you get the flu shot or not, don't let your health fall with the leaves this season. For News Channel 12, I'm Anna Williams.